Today, I'm going to show you how to use expressions in advanced actions. Using a question asked in the Adobe Captivate forum by one of our users. Thanks to Rod Ward, who is our community expert, for giving us a solution using expressions to achieve this workflow. The question was how to exclude a couple of slides from the total slide count. For that, Today I'm going to use variables and expressions as an action in advanced actions. First, let me create a variable that's called V underscore slide count. Save this. Now this project has around seven slides and the last two slides are help topics. That slide, the help topic slide is linked through a button which has a question mark. And when the user clicks on this help button, the help topic slides are displayed. Now, when somebody is taking this course, I would like to display only five slides as the counter and not the seven slides. But when we take the default system variable that would display the complete slide count. In this case, it is seven. Let's see how to exclude a couple of slides from that. I have de already defined a variable. Let me create an advanced action. As we all know, there are two types of actions, standard action and conditional action. I would take the standard action and uh, give the action name as my slide count and double click in the row for the action and select expression as my action. Now I'm defining an expression. While we are defining an expression, there are four elements to construct the expression. The first one is my variable, what I have defined, that is V underscore slide count. I'm calculating the final slide count and assigning it to the variable. For that, let me select a variable, which is a system variable, which is CP info slide count. And the operator is minus because I would like to exclude them. Literal is there are two slides which I would like to exclude. So the expression is V underscore slide count equals CP info slide count minus two. And this is saved as my slide count advanced action. Save this and close. Now let's go to the first slide and associate the action my slide count for on interaction. That means when the slide starts, then the advanced action gets executed and a value is given to V underscore slide count. Now we need to display this on the slide. How to do that? I'm going to insert a text caption here. And in that text caption, I will type total slides and then insert the variable v underscore slide count. Click OK. Let's uh, preview the project and see how many slides it would display. You can see here that the total number of slides is five in spite of its being seven. That's because from the total number of slides, two slides gets excluded. This is how we can actually create a customized counter for our course. Hope it helped. Thank you.